All right, just got to Aaron's. Um, we're gonna do some work on Thought for Food Record, um, some intros for the podcast, make a video, and just get some stuff done. So um, I will show you what we're doing today. Hey. Hello again. Hello again. Oh. What's happening, dude? How are you? Much. Nice fuzzy thing on the top. Yeah, I made it. Ho again? Homemade, yeah. Hi, baby. What are you doing? <laughs> don't drop me, daddy. Don't drop me. <laughs> Welcome to episode 37 of the Thought for Food podcast with Kaylee Martin. Sweet. Hey, buddy. How are you? I'm doing all right. I'm having a, a great uh, little fall day here. I'm having some allergies. I'm struggling. That's why I'm a little congested. I go back. I'm just going to stop this. We just, I just realized we forgot to do introductions. Like after, oh, to introduce after ourselves. the like after I introduced the podcast, you like jumped into Kaylee. Let's oh. wait. Let, let's let's do like okay, like how we usually do. You know the <laughs> intro, um, like intro intro the podcast and then intro ourselves. Okay, is that right? Is that right? and then like I think and then we can talk and then you can talk a bit about Kaylee, like brief intro to Kaylee, and then we'll talk about the issues. Okay. So for Lila's lunch today, we've got uh, brown rice with some pinto beans, and then we've got um, avocado and a bunch of nutritional yeast. And fat, and then B12 and the nutritional yeast, and like all the immune enhancing properties of that. It's just a good, good little lunch for her. Hashtag science. All right. Peace out, dude. I'm blogging. Don't do that. Bye, Lila. Hey, All right, good session at Aaron's. We just filmed a really funny video, which I'll show you in just a second. Banana and ice cream. We give a little taste test. Oh. I'll spoon feed you. This, you know, this is what we do here, thought for food. Oh. my bike. The key to making lots of banana ice cream is to have lots of bananas. <laughs> Canyon. Just a little short ride today, but um, so last night we interviewed uh, Sid Garza Hillman for the podcast over Skype, and he's just an awesome guy. If you haven't checked him out, go look him up, <clears throat> Sid Garza Hillman. Um, but anyway, one of his big philosophies is um, kind of approaching the natural. That's sort of his his deal. And um, one of the things that I just wanted to share with you guys, um, something that we talked about is integrative exercise. So it's not really natural for us to just go and ride up a mountain um, and then just sit around the rest of the day, um, like I do pretty much every day. Um, but what is natural is breaking up and integrating exercise into your daily routine. So if you're sitting at a desk all day, 
it's super you know beneficial to just get up and do five squats every hour or you know do some lunges or push-ups and, and just integrate those throughout the day just to move the body and um, you know just break it up so that you're not just sitting on your ass all day because that actually has been shown to um, be really correlated with um, morta high, higher levels of mortality disease etc so sitting is bad um, but yeah, so next time you're just sitting around, just try and remember to integrate um, exercise into your day, and I think you will find really solid results. So you can actually ride this dirt road all the way up this giant mountain, um, really steep and hard. I'm not gonna do that today. That is it for the video today, guys. Um, I wanna end this one pretty short, uh, pretty early today, but I'm gonna leave you with a pretty sweet um, time lapse of me descending this canyon on my GoPro. So. As always, go eat some plants. What's your thought for food? <laughs>